One of these guys will be in your grand finals fighting for the championship. Who's it gonna be? Knuckle Do or Lashaw? Both on fire today. I can't call it person. What about you? I know, I know. I mean, I feel like I always root for Knuckle Do, but watching Lashar play today, he's been playing amazingly well, has been showing off the tricks, yeah. has been proving that people are not going to get away with no free stuff on him. So We're in that any given Sunday zone yes. where any of these players, if it's their day, it's going to be their day. Oh, so the perfect him. parry today. He's ready that to was see disgusting. who's making the right reads and who's in form, right? Oh, so that read there. first execution error I've seen from Knuckle Do today. Yeah. Yeah, Let's change the momentum here. That semi-finals pressure. Surely not. Sneaking in. <laughs> and this is what we spoke about here. Is those booms on the screen. Again, he gets that accidental jump forward. Mm. Oh, oh, preemptive Zanshu. And see, this is kind of what I was mentioning before. That extra bit of aggression might go a long oh, way, but you can't test the reaction. Don't be testing the young boys. That just takes an early one. Gonna hop over, yep. Side switch, he had the hit there, didn't commit. Was looking for the shimmy. Another perfect parry there from the shot. Yeah, oh, trying to beat something out. Oh, Whoa. burn confirmed, the ting! Zero scaling, the juggle should kill. Yes, it will. Yeah, Bashar always seems to do a great job at putting the pokes in the perfect place. Like, you want to take a step forward, there's a, there's a button for that. And there's a jump as well there, Perser, as he lands that preemptive jump in the face at the stand throw, Knuckle doing an uncomfortable situation here. The shark gets off to a flying start in the second round. Again, again, he tests the reactions, man, I'm telling you. Again. And again, he's going to hop over. Will not to make the right call this time, though. He just backs away. He doesn't want to risk getting it wrong. Yeah, no oh, need to, right? He's got, you know, a lot of resources to work with. Doesn't need to go in and risk the OD tension on wake up. And the shot's been shown. No, no, nice. Harry. Mm. At the range where it's threatening oh, as well. Oh, the shot. This Woo. guy. I, I actually Please. spoke to... What's the kid's name, man? My brain's gone blank, but you know, the French bloody loot player. Kusanagi. Kusanagi, thank you. I spoke to Kusanagi yesterday, and he was saying the main difference between Lashar and Valmaster, who he trains with, is the guy's perfect parry rate is just insane. Well, the way that Lashar plays, he's moving forward and, and utilizing a number of various different buttons, but moving in and out as well. Valmaster normally trying to walk you down and abuse you with that standard light punch, mm -hmm. and it's very buttonsy. Whereas Lashar plays reactively and proactively, so he has that mental capacity to look for things to perfect parry as well. He does drive us straight into a boom. Drive Rush is in again, trying to maintain this pressure. He wants to stay in that range where the threat of the perfect parry is going to give him a significant reward, unlike Hibiki, who we saw in the first set Ooh. against Knuckle Doom. Well, this is the thing. chun -Li's not getting to play her usual, you know, uh, fireball game. She's having to absorb it. But when in these situations, she's usually guessing right. Gets away with that one, though. Again, Knuckle Doom's been able to get her into the corner. Punishes that. Could have got more there. Chose not to drive Rush in. Great check. <laughs> I mean, Lashar not being afraid, even when his back's against the wall, Agreed. not afraid. He just knows where to slip those buttons in. And look, he's meant to Ooh. slow down that momentum and he burns him out. Wake up button there, there's the right choice from Do. Try to get off. over oh, the I'm going to get a count here. Yeah. Beautiful conversion, that should be it. All right, Knuckle Do answering back. Okay, okay, we've got a real match here. Back and forth we go. And every round's been pretty much similar with Knuckle Do taking a, a significant lead, but. I thought Lashar has been able to close out on this occasion, though. Not to be able to get himself ahead. And again, those booms dictating the way they, they, they engage. After the boom is such an oppressive tool. Such a powerful tool. How do you get around that? And Lashar now fighting from the corner. Oh, gets oh, hit by the overhead. God, that's what's on store for you as well if you're asleep at the wheel. Oh, okay. level two. But Lashar too many. never asleep on defense. Proactive, looking for those gaps. Looking for those opportunities to turn the tide. Look at that corner carry as well, Logan. Yeah, exactly. Coast to coast. Ooh, to pay out of last kick. Trade. Ooh. Big life lead here for Have you finished this combo? One more. Nice. Just, Just enough. enough. Clean. Strong Levels response up. after that first game. And they're already back in there. There's like no, no time to wait. <laughs> Just changed, up the, in there. just changed up the pattern a little bit there, didn't he? Lashar just looks a bit less comfortable. Wow, Jinx. <laughs> Shut your mouth, F word, as he passes out another perfect parry to punish that boom. Meet your overhead well blocked. Whoa. What a beautiful Ooh. whip punish. Oh, 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 this guy. Always has the right button, but Knuckle Doom using the meter, waking gonna, up with it. I want to say something quite bold, Persia. Have we seen an OD flash get blocked from Knuckle Doom yet today? Man's looking to get Bun out. Here we go. I don't think we have. I mean, when he's got the right read. 
too oppressive and too hard to deal with. You know, he's making you guess. Ooh, he's jab. waking up. <laughs> the jab was too early. He got punished, Karen. Nice oh, slide on reaction. Punch. Consistent. Last kick. This is a very tight round. Pretty much even right now. Another perfect parry. Ooh, Ooh the frame trap. That's the trap around. Oh, oh, he burns himself out. That's bad. Very good situational awareness there from Knuckle Do. All angles covered, I must say. Yes. Fantastic play from Knuckle Do to close out that round, but it's still only game three here. Big whip punish. Didn't cancel. Oh, he was waiting for it. I've got to get into doing that, you know. Yeah. <laughs> all the top players are doing that. Why don't I do that? Minus two parry, baby. Just do it. All right, let's see if Lashar can make use of having Knuckle Dew in the corner at this range where he can probably react to a lot of different things, but cool. no, Knuckle Dew fights his way out easily. He's starting to make the right read when he gets in with that boom block, block thumb pressure. Here it comes again. Will he make the right read again? Yes, he does. Standing. He's getting mixed up. High low mix up the overhead, the crouch and medium kick. Finally it's gets. working for Dew. And that's the big difference from the first game. This offense is actually paying off for Dew. Making He's the right reads. openings and converting on them. Commentator's curse there, though, is another perfect parry. Changed the tie, but no, not exactly as he lands this one. Towards the corner you go. Safe jump. Whoa. Oh. No, boom came, yeah. Oh, he committed. Yeah, yep. there was no cancel. Did not work out for Lashar that time. Knuckles you taking the lead in this set. I mean, that's the beauty of a best of nine, though. You can kind of take those risks early on in the set. But eventually, you got to start conserving. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Actually, counter hit a delayed button there from Dune. He's sent to the corner because of it. Big chunk of damage. Ooh. Oh, my God, that hit. He was looking for a stand for it. Yeah, just hit Crouch for some reason. Dude just froze him. Was probably looking for a DI or something. He's reacting so well to them. Another perfect parry. So casually whips them out. That's the shot. Wants to get back into the range where those perfect parries count. Oh, the knockdown. Perfect parry count is. <laughs> It's unbelievable. Crazy high right now, trying to throw him off with a drive rush freeze. And again! But there's another perfect parry from Lashar. And we go into the corner. Oh, no, yeah, no. He's gonna get that bet's no. not going to pay off. What a strange bet from Knuckle, who's something he knows that we no, don't. That's going to cost him the round. Level one. Very nice, very nice. We are seeing Lashar just hang on to that range. The perfect range needs to be in for dear life. He was like, this is where I want to live. Oh, that's going to hurt. Yeah, he's so good at fighting from that range first. He can just kick back, take his time. Has to absorb a lot of pressure, because as you see, every time he parries on yeah. these boots, it's not perfect. Nothing to do gets him with plus range. But every now and then, he gets a scramble like this in his favor and makes the momentum count. Counting hit light punch, but nothing after it. A rare drop from the shot. He's probably committed to nothing. Back to neutral we go. Yeah, he's definitely showing off his patience. Oh, oh that's massive. Go. He's going to recover a bunch of ga gauge here as well. I was worried about his burnout, but that is a massive turning point. Trying to make it two apiece. The empty stomp. Oh, he had the hit. Ooh. It's still looking good for Lashar right now, though. Gets the throw. He thankfully has enough drive gauge in the corner. Ooh. Doesn't burn him out from that as well. Ooh, oh, he does now, burns though. Him out. Overhead hits as well. So close to chip. Oh, oh and there it is. The OD boom. Closing it out for Do. Pulls himself into the lead. Looking to make it 3-1. He's got the level two here going into the final round, which is actually a good situation for Chun-Li. Changes the matchup significantly. boom has got to be a bit less... What? He committed. Oh, oh yeah, he's already done the move with What a call out. Reacted to the green flash. Yeah. And he committed to that. He got a perfect parry. That's what allowed him to get that super out so quickly. His perfect parry rate is just unbelievable. Mm. Knuckle do fighting from the corner now, fighting well, but huge life deficit. Oh, oh. gets caught low! Gonna get a little free and he's gonna get burnt out as well! Was he anticipating the overhead that time? Possibly, I'm not sure, but Knuckle do definitely needed that to close this life lead. Oh, trade in. That one looked like it might be plus. Oh, nice. Oh, oh the legs protect him from that. Gets punished. Oh, reset. It's all working out. Knuckle do goes into a 3 1 lead here in this Red Bull Kumite NYC semi final. And Lashar with it all to do. Sneaking that in when you least expect it. What a turning point, man. 
Michal's playing this neutral superbly, but the openings are just not being converted into as much as they can be. Maybe he's just a little bit wary, not committing fully, but there's been a few openings here that he could have converted into big damage. No such drawbacks for Knuckle Doom. He is taking absolutely every chance and putting big damage up on the board. I'm stunned by how well he's, how well he's perfect parry in the slow boom. Oh, oh! man, connects! And back into the corner we Same go. Jump. Back, that's his out, there's nothing to do. Trade hit, Ooh. fighting from the corner. Garland's always fought from the corner so well, and every street for us. Maybe more so here than others. Oh, wow. Trade it's gonna burn her out again. You have to stay there, recover your gauge. Here he comes. Nice. Oh, he walks in. Burnout now, where's the level two? Is it coming? Yeah, he knows he can't throw those booms. Oh, bad yeah. job. Dude, just gonna hold on to that super gauge. Holding that right. Oh no! Okay. Dragon no. suplex. Oh, oh again! <laughs> Even when you're playing on a keyboard like this guy, walk yeah. forward block is still very difficult to do. The jump in at the start of the round, he's gonna level three. Yes, he is! What a way to start this round with a massive life lead. Yeah, he gets a lot of that drive gauge back that he spent on that combo also. Oh, spent the plus frames. Just takes the throw. The shot. Bust out of the corner though. Got to. You got to sometimes. Oh, 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 my, oh my goodness. Knuckle Doom's offense is flowing. Everything connecting. Everything being converted. And he's 4-1 up now. Looking to close it out. And disgusting. make this an all North American Kumite here in NYC. <laughs> oh, we're never going to head the end of this one, guys. <laughs> Somebody do this, man. Do. Oh, beautiful interruption there. The perfect parry on the boom, and he jabs Ooh. out of the bazooka knee. So lashar has got a lot of answers here. He has. Playing just superbly well. The amount of reward he's getting for it is just not enough in this matchup. It's so uphill the way Knuckle Doo plays it. And Knuckle Doo's really playing to golf strengths there, regardless of the perfect parries. Ooh. Nice. Another one. Can he make this count? The empty stomp again. Oh, two oh. plus. Oh. Throw whiff. We're still in blocks down there. Three perfect parries in a row there from the shot. All speed variations of the boom. This guy's been in training mode for a long time. It's gonna get burnt out again. It's been a feature of the matchup. Burns himself Ooh, out. Let's watch close this. Yes, the counter hits that jab. Closes it out. I mean, Knuckle Dude's playing in such a way that it's kind of making Lashar second guess a lot of his tried and true options that he's going for. So hopefully you can just shake that off. You gotta bring what you know every time. He's just leaving a, a very small margin for error, right. though, you know? So even when you get scenarios like this in the sequence, it's costing Lashar meter to get him there. And he knows as yeah. long as he gets him low enough, he can bring it back every single time, which is what Ooh. he's done. And here we go. This is exactly what we're talking about. He's gonna get a level. No, he's gonna go to level three. He's gonna go to level two, and level one instead, sorry. Back to neutral. We go burnt out. Horrible situation for Lashar. Oh, oh. Rango! I have never seen someone play this well. And, and been this far down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know, it's crazy. Like, Lashar's making godlike plays. Yes. He just landed that, but he's, he's still in burnout. He's still got an uphill battle. And level two's there if Knuckle wants to activate it. There's a 10 shot. He's going to get his meter back now. All right, it is St. Ooh. Patrick's Day, so we're back in the green for Lashar. I love that, Logan. <laughs> Can he Saving get a rounder? One, Can he get a game here? Oh, no, Knuckle oh. going to close it. It's set point, Knuckle Do. Lashar just can't get him off him. And has not really been breaking those throws either. So over time, it just adds up and adds up. You know what? Right, so again, I don't blame him. Into the green stuff. Let's the OD. Oh, oh he's again. He's burned out. Oh, this is horrible. Oh, so right, important. So answer. important. Trust get out of the corner. He's gonna. Oh, he's guaranteed. Yeah, he's no he can't do nothing. This time. Watch, right. out Watch out for the reset. Watch out for the reset. Watch out for the reset. No, he's just gonna do combos. Okay. Straight into the level three. I love that. It's gonna actually freeze. Yeah. The drive gauge as well. So horrible situation here. More gauge back for himself to maintain his corner pressure as well. No! Oh! Oh! Out of reaching. Doom. Knuckle takes it. So strong. So strong. Damn, knuckle dude on absolute smoke, guys. And he just seems to get stronger and stronger as this tournament goes on. And he's booked his place in the grand finals of Red Bull Kumite, a place I don't think I've seen him before. He's obviously won some massive tournaments. I mean, for a long time, we hadn't seen Knuckle Do. He was out of the game. He was retired. He was a crypto trader. Yeah, when you're talking about, you know, the, the American greats, 
Nakhudu obviously comes up, but for a, a, a very big part of Street Fighter V, he was exactly, not exactly. part of the, uh, of the scene of the community competitively. But he has come back with a vengeance, with a work ethic that, you know, is almost unparalleled. He has been entering almost every weekly event. A fantastic run from him. And that is paying Just off. Running right his now. own event as, event as well. Must add that, Logan. Mm -hmm. He looks incredible. I mean, Persia, I, I'm sure you're impressed by the way he played there. He's booked himself pl a place in the final. It's going to be up against Punk or Mena. Just a matter of time before we find out. Yep, and we'll find out very soon. But first, we got to talk to the boss, Rob. Take it away. This man just did enough talking with his fists, so I'm not going to ask him anything. Knuckle Dude, you are officially our first competitor in the grand finals of Red Bull Kumite. Lashar, you just put on a phenomenal performance at Capcom Cup. Now, I would like to personally request that Capcom investigate his controller he used, because there's no way he became this trash that fast. It's impossible. You love mediocrity. New York loves mediocrity, clearly. That's why you root for the Knicks. Clearly. Lashar, your time here is done. Come with me. Oh, before we do that, before we do that, I guess we should make some noise for my man, one of the strongest players in the world, Lashar! 